Welcome back to my new channel. This is the Average American Investor. Um, again, a disclaimer, this video is for educational purposes only. I'm not a financial advisor. Um, so if you need financial advice, please contact your local financial advisor. Um, <clears throat> today I wanted to talk about the stock market. Uh, the Dow is at about 25,000, which is historically fairly high. Um, and in particular, I wanted to talk about Phil Town's stock portfolio. So Phil Town, of course, he's a famous investor. Um, his portfolio is made up of about two thirds cash and about one third stocks. Plus he also trades in um, options such as calls and puts. Um, I wanted to mention that one of Phil's stocks that he owns is Bank OZK. And I found Bank OZK interesting because it pays about a 4.7% dividend, which is a really good dividend. So for anybody who's looking to buy individual stocks, uh, they may want to take a look at Bank OZK. Um, again, the Dow's at about 25,000, which is historically still relatively high, um, which is interesting given the, given the, the situation. Um, that the stock market remains fairly high. And I think the reason for that is because what you have is you, the big investors, um, such as the head funds, the Warren Buffetts, uh, they're not going to just dump all their stocks in a, in a down market. So I think that's one reason why the market is staying relatively high. Um, because, of course, stocks and bonds, it's all about supply and demand. So apparently there's still healthy demand for stocks um, there's a limited supply of stocks so I think you know given the supply and demand and the fact that the big players are not selling their stocks I think that's one reason why uh, stocks are still fairly high also of course the Federal Reserve Bank uh, they're pumping money into the economy they're buying bonds they're lending money at almost zero percent interest um, so again, you know, if you want to look at an individual stock, take a look at Bank OZK. Um, you know, I don't see the market collapsing at this point. So anyway, please um, subscribe to my channel down below. Um, hit the like button, leave a comment. Again, this is the average American investor.